Hi, my name is Dean Rust and welcome to my website, bluebirdconservation.com. Today I'm going to show you an easy method to discourage house sparrows from taking over your bluebird box. House sparrows have been the number one enemy for years for the bluebird. An easy way to drive them away is to put a skylight in, in your box. Whether you have a new box or whether you have an old box, I'm going to show you a technique that will take 15 minutes of your time, about two dollars of your money and you will have a bluebird box that is house sparrow resistant. To make a skylight in your old box or new box first of all you'll need a quarter inch drill you'll need a two and a half inch hole saw you'll need a Phillips screwdriver you'll need a marking point a pencil one eighth inch drill four three quarter inch screws a straight edge a ruler and you'll need a piece of twin walled polycarbonate. In this case we're using an old nest box. This is one you've had for years but you've had trouble. You've had some house sparrows on occasion. You've had some bluebirds but the house sparrows have been a problem. We're going to put a skylight in this. First of all with a straight edge find the center point above the living cavity not the overhang but a center point of the living cavity of the box. In other words the floor space. Once you find the center point Mark it with a pencil, take your drill and drill, and make a two and a half inch hole right through the top of the box, right through the top of the box. Then take a piece of twin wall polycarbonate, place it over the box, pre-drill screw holes about an inch and a half in and an inch and a half down on all four corners. If you're building a new box, it's somewhat easier. You have the body of the box made. This happens to be a Virginia box. Your top is about eight and a half by 11. You pre-drilled your two and a half inch hole. This is what the Lexan looks like with four screws. The top left, top right, bottom left, bottom right. Four screws will hold this. You don't need any putty, any glue, and then place it on top of the roof and tighten it down. And you have either a brand new box with a skylight or you can re retrofit your old box with a skylight. Congratulations you are finished with your Bluebird Nest Box skylight. I have used this on many trails and this technique has saved the lives of a lot of bluebirds and made a lot of happy homeowners because they had a box that their bluebirds were safe. For a little bit of your time and a couple dollars of cost, you can ensure that bluebirds will come to your nest box and your yard for years to come. Good luck and happy bluebirding.